as we head into 2KW Pro 5, presented by ILoveMountVernon.com, we have one of the most interesting matches in 2KW Pro history. As Ariella Nix competes for the first time in a 2KW Pro ring, teaming with her former boss, Cashflow Ken Broadway, against the ultimate challenger, EA James. From Broadway's debut at 2KW Pro 3, the man from money-making Manhattan was primed to be a top star in 2KW Pro, but one man stood in his way on the path to the main event, EA James. James, a man looking for a challenge at any time, was scheduled to take on the Millionaire Killionaire this past January at 2KW Pro 4. But an appearance on run-in radio sweetened the pot. I'm, I'm willing to bet heavy money. Matter of fact, I'm, I might bet maybe, maybe 10 racks, you know, a little, a little breakfast money. And if you beat me, you can have all of that. We're going we to put some money on the line. 10K, if you could pin me one, two, three, or make me check out in the middle of that ring. 10K. That's a lot of money. Can I get in on this bet? Maybe, maybe you could use that to buy yourself a nice, a nice looking suit, because I know you be dressing bummy on, on, a, like, on occasion. So 10K, if you could pin Mr. Moneybag in the middle of that ring, and I'm pretty sure you can't. So like I said, fans, listen to this, get your tickets. Cause it's gonna it's gonna be crazy. January sixteenth, Bronx, New York, Donald's Gym. It's two KW Pro. I'm sending EA Games into retirement. Soon after that major offer was thrown on the table, two KW Pro matchmaker and management representative AJ Orsini made it official, as we would have the first ever cash flow ten thousand dollar challenge. That night, James and Broadway put on two amazing performances and we're looking to reach not only the highest levels in 2KW Pro, but for the 10 grand that was on the line. James was only one spear and three seconds away from making history in the Bronx. But Ariella Nitz had other ideas. Proper manager Ariella Nitz distracting the ref. EA James about to attack her possibly. Will he slap? Will he kiss? Oh, blocks the slap. He blocked the slap. He might give a kiss to Ariella Nix right now. Rolling elbow misses. No, no. Feminism water planted on her back. Schoolboy counter. Oh, I'm making that a kick. Come on. Soon after, an incensed James wanted another match with Broadway, but AJ Orsini had other ideas, making this match a handicap match to ensure that Nitz would be in the ring and not on the outside. But an issue occurred. Soon after this match was signed, Ken Broadway fired Ariella Nitz from his organization, leaving the both of them at major odds. Nitz was so infuriated that she demanded a different match altogether. AJ Orsini put all these matters to rest last week in a statement regarding the many questions surrounding 2KW Pro 5. Here we stand, hours away from this major match in 2KW Pro history. Can James answer the challenge? Or will Broadway and Nitz, for one more night, be able to make it rain on their opponents?